Michigan may have a special place in his heart, but Gorris is also a businessman who sees real opportunity here. Absolutely. Don Shane, talk to him tonight at the palace. Don, what was he like? He was terrific is what he was. He was he fun-loving? Well, I mean, look dancing. at him. Uh, like it? I met him for the first time and walked away going, wow, this could be great. Tom Gores was really friendly. He was engaging. He was open. He was honest. He was impressive. But maybe most of all, he was absolutely thrilled to be the new owner of the Pistons. And confident approval by the NBA will happen and happen quickly. He did not want to upstage Karen Davidson on the last night of the regular season. Karen told me, it's his night, not mine. He sat next to her for part of the game and was introduced to the crowd to the song of California Dreamin'. Before all that, I had a chance to talk with Tom, who came into the suite full of enthusiasm. Yeah. So what I was saying is it's a community asset. So we have to do this together. I'm excited. Excited is not actually the right word, ecstatic. I'm back in Michigan, where, where I grew up, and I appreciate everybody welcoming me back. Is this kind of a dream come true for you to own this team? It's interesting about, about dreams, right? I mean, of course, I always, you know, wanted to own a sports team, um, but it came together. It, everything came together at the, at the right time. Uh, I grew up with sports, and, but mostly I'm excited about inspiring the town. And, and we have to, we're together on this thing. Right, this is a community asset. Tom, a, a lot of different owners out there. Guys are more hands-on. Guys are more upfront. You know, you know the Mark Cubans, the Jerry Joneses sure. of the world. What kind of ownership? What kind of owner will you be? I'll be whatever owner this team needs and this franchise needs. So when they need me back, I'll be back. Uh, I will be impactful. That's for sure. I'll, I want us to be successful. I didn't show up here to not be successful. When you say impactful, can you describe what you mean by that? Whatever it takes. Are we afraid of change? Absolutely not. We're ready for change. No, no problem. Sometimes you need change. But we, we are going to learn right now. And there is a great deep organization here that existed before us. And we need to make the most out of that. This is not a culture you throw away. This is an unbelievable city. It's an unbelievable organization. How long did Bill own the team? 30 some years, right? We need to take advantage of that. And uh, I, I want to make Bill Davidson proud huh. that we bought the team. How great a statement is that and how very impressive he was tonight. It is easy to see why he is such a successful businessman and man. He was fun, a lot more coming up during his sports about 20 minutes from now. Wow, the sounds place. like he believes in this town and believes yeah. in this state. And he to... believes in himself. That's, hey. a, that's a strong <laughs> word, impactful. 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 Whatever it takes. Exactly. As a sports fan in this city, when you hear a new owner say, whatever it takes, you love it. All right. We'll talk to you more in a couple minutes about it. Get her done.